Don't waste the opportunity. <laughs> They haven't put up much of a fight, yet. It is a good day. I think I could get any stronger. by your weakness. You know what to do. There's still time for you to run away. The light will heal you. Thank you, friend.
interesting. Position compromised. Engaging target. I will remember your face. Won't be enough. Take this. Wonder what the desertion rate is for Hydra lackeys. Excellent work. Why is it that for every one of these sites we take out, it seems like two more appear in their place? Patience. Hydra certainly lives up to their name. I've hunted an actual Hydra. That was easier. It's easier than this. <laughs> I live up to my name. Christ crossbones put on your head. Runt. Too bad he never said it had to stay attached to your body. Well, too bad for you. Big words. For a dead man. You got one thing right today, Sabretooth. Heads are definitely about to roll. Another mangy stray. You smell wrong. Compared to him? Good point. And now I get to kill two runs with one claw. Maybe I should be paying Hydra. Before he can hurt anyone else. Who you call an animal, lady? Check your ears, Creed. She didn't stutter. <laughs> Want it done right? Gotta do it yourself.
Looks like they called for help. So, is he some sort of werewolf? He is not a cold-blooded killer. Shall be of great help. Should do the trick. Once I'm done here, maybe I'll visit that little castle of yours. You're just lucky. Not me. This one has the stink of death on him. A past filled with the suffering of innocent victims.
Nobody makes me. Strongest was no match for us. Can he heal from that too? No, no. But I'm gonna make sure he doesn't. Yeah. Nice to meet you too. Sounds like you had some unexpected visitors out there. Those two beasts came out of nowhere. Who were they? Victor Creed and James Logan Howlett. But I'm sure they'd prefer to go by their current aliases. 
Sabretooth and Wolverine. Those two have been at each other's throats for decades. Wolverine? Then he is a werewolf? Huh. I did not sense that from either of them. Because they are mutants. Like me. You are... like them? I will not be howling at the moon anytime soon, Hunter. It affects us all in different ways. There are some things you'll need to become familiar with in our post-atomic world, Hunter. Mutants being a big part of that. A blessing or a curse in the blood, depending on who you ask. I can explain further if you must know. In the meantime, I need to look into what's happening in New York. Wolverine is an honorable man, if a bit rough around the edges. Sabretooth, on the other hand, is a homicidal maniac. The fact that he's got his sights set on you is definitely not good news. Wait, you know Logan? Who do you think first told me about you? You'd be surprised how many people have found their way into these woods over the years. And once they do, they tend to find a way back. I doubt this is the last we have seen of either of them. Wonderful. Logan and I are not exactly best friends or anything. He's more my brother, Piotr's friend. Like I said earlier, we're all mutants. Not to freak you out or anything. You say mutant as if it is a bad thing. In some parts of the world, it is a very bad thing. You've been sl So it is safe to- That's an under- So you and these other- Hardly. We're all part- Just like- Hmm, I get- And this- Definitely not an X-Man. He and Wolverine go way back- He has been tr- Are you sure it was him? I hope this- <laughs> You should be so lucky. If Logan ever killed him, I think he'd be... Thank you for exp... Of course. But all you need... You should be more careful. Syria. Having Sabretooth... How much? Quite a bit. I have two... Well, Logan... If we're... And... Then... I suppose... Shop class tonight. You free? I am ready. Right on. Good instincts, but you want to tighten up the array. Uh, like this? Close. Here, I can show you. Uh, what's all the, uh, new equipment? Ah, the supplies? No need to thank me. Donated to the cause, courtesy of five Stark subsidiaries. Wow, that's... it's really something. Yeah, it's a bit of a mess, but just take what you need. I'll clear out the rest, I promise. Awesome. That's great. Huh. What is wrong? It's nothing. Did you know Tony Pla No, did you? Nope. How's it going, boss? Ready to get your hands green? Tony, why did you bring all this? Really? The old stuff has a junkyard. No problem. But I would... I was just taking up... How? I carted it, crate by crate, through limbo. Don't bring it up with... I dropped a spectrum. So, about... But you kids are doing... Glad you cleared that up with Tony. Another day for re- I have the component. I'm ready to put- I am ready.
Is that it for today? No Hydra agents go against us and get to work. Good girl, Charlie. <laughs> I needed that. Relaxing. Hunter, if you're receiving this message, please come to the central console as soon as possible. That is... odd. Dr. Banner, you have re-emerged. I'm sorry, Hunter. Probably not the best impression of me. Uh, but now I'm back. And we are happy to have you back, Doctor. We were worried for a brief moment. Thank you for your concern, but I'm fine. Doing better than our comm system was. I was knocked offline by a spike in gamma radiation that tore through the electromagnetic spectrum. Bad day to be a Manhattan cell phone tower. But don't worry, I've isolated the problem here. No more blackouts, I promise. But I am concerned about the other ripple effects this gamma radiation could have caused. That's why I would like to scan you and see if the shifts in energy have affected you. Anything, if you think it will help your research. Immensely. It's quite possible it can give us a clue on how to counter this gamma shift. Just stand very still. You shouldn't feel a thing. And we're done. Once I analyze this scan, we'll all be much wiser. Thank you, Hunter. <laughs> <laughs>